Uh, on the right, we have uh, quarterback Brian Wilson. On the left, Marcus Monroe. Uh, Brian, in the first half alone, had 11 of 12 for like 155 yards. Marcus finished with almost 100 yards receiving and one touchdown. Does that sound? Yeah. Um, Brian, a lot of people, including this writer, expected the game to be close. Why did you guys dominate tonight? You know, we were able to control the trenches. The line is amazing. Our defense, they held them to zero points, barely any yards, like 60 yards, something like that. Defense was great, and I was able to make connections with all the receivers, especially Marcus, Andrew Aguilar, all the guys. Okay. Coming into this game, you know, people thought this was going to be a battle of running backs. You know, you had Jacob and Elijah. They had uh, Braden and Noah. The running game for you guys was okay, but for them it was almost non-extinct. You guys became the stars of the game. Coming into this game, what did you think was going to be the difference? Did you think it was going to be you guys, or did you think it was going to be a running game? I felt like we would pass more because they're um, putting everybody in the box, so like they're putting single coverage on us, and okay. I just felt like we have better talent and then we just finish them off. Are you a senior? Yeah. So, you know, Brian's a freshman. He has three more shots of this. You only got five games. Mm -hmm. So the fact that you got to play 3-0, 3-0, and um, against two really good teams, and you guys just dominated, how satisfying was that tonight? It was just really good playing with the guys that we've been um, playing with since freshman year and yeah. What did you like when you got the ball what, all those catches, you know, how happy were you that your guy was, you know, throwing to you all night? Good man. What, the ball felt so good because I last year I didn't get the ball that much. What can you say about his, you know, just being a freshman and looking so steady out there, looking so calm, what would you want to say about him as a freshman and the and the leader of the offense? I feel like he got so much talent, he got room to grow, get even better. He'll be the best quarterback in the nation. Woo! You heard that, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Um, is it hard? How do you stay humble? Because you're having a lot of success. I've talked to a lot of people who said, you know, that you're considered really highly ranked, even as a freshman. Um, is it hard to stay humble, or is that something you get at home? No, humility is something that I've always been taught. It's pretty easy. Your family, your parents? Yeah, pretty easy for me. You know, I always have, I'm always confident, but still be humble is one of the things that my parents instilled in me. So on kind of a sad note, like, what would you want to say to your buddy who's probably having surgery right now yeah dennis man he is probably a really good kicker he was but it's one of your guys didn't you just feel terrible yeah it was horrible you know what do you want to say to him though just go ahead wish him wish luck. Him luck yeah get yeah, better man well. we want to see you come back come back strong season all for you okay. yeah, it's all for you dennis